Dover, which is super cool. I caught the train uh, from London this morning and it is a super cute town. I'm loving it already. Um, I literally only got off the train just now. Um, could see the white cliffs coming in, which is also amazing. Um, so I am going to walk up to the castle because A, I'm stingy and B, I think it'll be a lovely walk. Uh, supposedly about an hour, so who knows if that'll take me an hour and a half at the moment or if it's actually an hour for like slow walkers, but we'll, we will see and I'll take you on the ride. I mean, I went to private schools, but shit, that out. That's a school and a half right there. So, I've made some potentially poor life choices today. <laughs> I am walking up to Dover Castle, which is a hike. Ah, uh, but <laughs> But it's also a hike in pouring rain. My feet are already soaked. And we're gonna just, I mean, I'm looking behind to see if there's people. There's not gonna be people who are mad like me walking in this today. But I'm gonna have fun anyway, and I'll get dry tonight. So fun times, walking. I may or may not have already fallen face first, scrape my knee. I mean, I've got jeans on, so I assume there's a scrape there. It didn't go through the pants, so should be sweet. This is going to be a long day. Past the point of no return, commit and march on. not the terrain that Connie's are designed for. I don't know what I was thinking. And each bit further I go, I'm skeptical that the path is actually properly cleared because there's been a few bits of sketchy. So I'm just hoping I don't have to turn around because that would suck. See how we go. because I think Fifel fell out of my pocket when I slipped A over T on the hill. I'm covered in mud. I'm up at the castle, but I am... Um, <laughs> I'm gonna... well, got to. That's a strong word. I 
am most likely going to wander the castle and then head down the same way I came to try and see if I can find my little buddy because otherwise I'll be a sad lady and have to do a second in memoriam video. So we will see what happens. <laughs> so I've bought myself a condolence cider. <laughs> Just in case tears need to come later. <laughs> See what happens. I hope Fifal is okay. <laughs> Find Fifal and not stack on the wet path back to town. Fingers crossed! I cannot believe what has just happened right now. I'm absolutely like losing my mind excited because look who I found. I found Fifal! He's been here all day near a major road right near where I started my day today. I literally backtracked after leaving the castle. It took everything in me not to leave earlier to go and try and find him when I realised he was gone. But I found him! <laughs> Amazing!
Kevin. I'm sorry I never found you, but Fifel is back. He's safe with me. What a whirlwind. Absolute whirlwind. Weather was fine. It was this. It was fine. It was this. Fifel was gone. He's back. What a great day. I'm absolutely soaked through. I'm going back to the train to go down to the south coast and I have Fifel to run with me. Amazing! I'm currently on the train, so I'm trying to be a little bit fun, but today I have spent the day at Dover where it's been pouring on and off, but of course now it decides to be sunny as soon as I leave here, but that's okay. Um, I am on the train towards Ashford where I will change and go down to Rye Harbour. Well, to Rye and then Rye Harbour to visit the lovely Bruces who I am very excited The next to station see. is in Ashford years. International. Um, so I am getting very excited for that. The next stop is Ashford so I need to be wary of that. <laughs> I'm going to get off soon. Um, but yeah, it's been an awesome day in Dover, at Dover Castle and uh, many people chatting to people like I do and just, yeah, getting to learn some history and being amongst it. It's been a great day. It's only a couple of days in. This is the best holiday already. Mm -hmm.